And welcome everyone to part 81 of Let's Play Let's Play Donkey Kong 64 with me, Homestar92. So, if you remember our last part, we went into a little door, and so we're starting off this part with a mini game. A mini game in which we have to collect a certain number of coins, which I have forgotten. But it's okay because the little bird said what it was, and if you need to know, you can look there. And you also need to avoid enemies, because there are enemies here. And they will do various things to try to hurt you. And as is always the rule with these cart games, you get hurt, you lose three coins. So, I'm doing a pretty sucky job right now, but I actually did not have to do this more than once. So, this mini game can be difficult at times. And now you get a little dodging mini game. Kind of difficult, a little bit. And no, the coins you dropped, you do make a second wrap. Second wrap. Second lap. You make a second lap. But, um, I think I kind of got confused saying round and lap. But, you make a second lap, but the coins you dropped do not stay dropped. They just kind of vanish, so. If you drop a coin, you won't be getting that coin back. So if you drop a certain number of coins, you're totally done. And you can also... You can break by pulling back on the joystick. That's... Kinda common sense for these kinda games, but... Just thought I'd explain that little mechanic. So yeah, dodge his fists. Keep your coins. Uh, bu -bu -bu. There we go. You don't wanna hit things. If you hit things, that is the opposite of good, and it causes you to lose coins. Well, if the coin goal was 25, I'm getting there. In fact, I'm there now. But I don't know what the coin goal was. Maybe it was 25. And what happens here is we turn around. That's basically it. We now get turned around. Isn't that fun? So all these tombstones are already up from where we triggered them last time. So, same rules as before. Try not to hit them. And you'll do great. And this is going to be a short part, I can already tell you. So, you know. Sorry about that. Well, it can't be too short, because, I mean, the whole length of my three parts is 32 minutes. So this part can't be too short. But it is... Jeez, we're at 30. So if that was the number, we're also good, because I don't remember what it was. All I can say is, spoiler alert, I get it. So, spoiler alert, I get the banana. So, yeah. So it's just basic stuff. Sorry, I'm not really talking. There really isn't much to say. My allergies are dreadful. I'm really sorry. I'm probably grossing you all out. But I really wanted to get this recorded. So... You know. I wanted to get it done, so I had to take care of it. Now is better than later, am I right? And 164 bananas. So there you go. And 
Now we need to get in this little room with Chunky Kong. And we need to find his banana port because it's fairly well hidden, it would seem. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that now. Ah, it's right there. Well, that was easy. Okay. Well. Let's go get him then. I think we've got... We've still got a couple more bananas to get in this part. Before I call it a day. So, once I'm done recording this, I will have six parts ready for upload. Of course, by the time you're done watching this, I will have only three parts still ready for upload. So, you know. You don't know, actually. You have no idea what goes on behind the scenes. Which is unfortunate for you, I guess. And in the door we go. Oh yeah, I remember Chunky's banana. It was super easy. You basically punch a few things, and that's it. Not too difficult at all, I must say. And I'm an idiot. Ignore me. Don't do that. Instead, you want to either continue to hold down Z or move yourself off of the little pad before you press Z. Alright, now if you look around the room, there are some coffins. Watch this. You can break them. Inside, you have regular bananas and some. And in whichever happens to be the last one you break, you will have golden bananas. Unless you do them in a different order and you just end up getting the golden banana. But it's not just any golden banana, as you will come to find out. And coins, yep, over 100. It's not just any golden banana, it is a bonus game banana barrel blast. Welcome to bonus day. And it's Searchlight Seek, which is not the hardest. The hardest is Beaver Bother. And I never have to see that horrible game again because I've already recorded the part that has it. And it took me 137 attempts. But I did get it. So, you will get to witness my elite skill as I clear this on my first attempt. Maybe. Through the magic of editing, you don't know. It may have been my first attempt, or it may have been my 137th. I'll just tell you right now, this one didn't take me 137 attempts. At most, this one took five. This minigame is not excessively difficult. Beaver Bother is excessively difficult. La 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 la. Come here, you little claptrap. That's actually his name. He's called a claptrap, and I didn't even plan on hitting him that time. So we've got ten seconds left to hit two of them. Which, oh yeah, we got this. Last second, baby. Last second. How you like that? And we got it, so let's jump for joy and grab our banana. And that's gonna probably be it for this part, so let's get ourselves oriented a bit, see if we can get up here. There might be something up here. There's probably a balloon in this room or something. No. Well, that's very interesting. But, let's see, I've got about a minute and a half before I reach the end of this recording session, so... Can't really say my goodbye yet. Not quite time for that. I distinctly remember there being one more banana I wanted to get. If it's even possible, which I doubt. But, um... In the next few parts, we're going to cover a lot of ground with bananas, and we're going to knock the better part of this level out, so... And we're going to knock out the worst part of the level, which is very nice. Can I get in here? I don't think so. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of walking around to kill time. So... I guess, as long as I'm just walking around to kill time, that's going to just about do it for this part. Um... We're only going to have a few parts left in Creepy Castle. We're probably only going to have somewhere between three and six parts left. So, well, that was smart. 
So in the next part we're going to try to cover as much ground as possible. And I am Homestar92. And I guess I will see you in the next part. Even though I have a good 10 seconds left of this one. So in the next part we'll get more bananas. I'm Homestar92. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.